the day. Welcome to Kmo's Everything. Today we have really cool arcade games, 16 great games. I don't remember you go back like in Walmart, different stores, or the Kmart, and, you know, they always have like the really expensive games. Then they have these compilations for like, you know, 5 to $10, and you think, oh, man, I can afford 5 or 10 bucks. And then you get it home and you realize they suck. They really suck. And let me tell you something. Uh, I don't know. Well, you'll see. Uh, basically, really cool arcade games, uh, 100% classic arcade actions. He's got two pictures. Uh, 16 sweet arcade favorites. Oh, they use the word sweet on one CD-ROM. Blast, Aliens, Dodge, Speeding, Asteroids, and Save the Earth will the best collection of everyone's favorites on the planet. Oh, that's kind of weird. And you see it's got, oh, here's the, here's the great games. Amium Command, Chomp, Her, Miss Chomp, Space Rocks, Space Rocks, 3D, Ultra Blast, Warhead, Arkanoid. Hey, I recognize that name. Uh, Defender, I recognize that. Hyperoid, Space Invaders 96, Space Wars, Squirmer, whack rat Oh, it's got whack rat And Winroids. So, kind of get the idea what this is. A lot of uh, knockoff games. Uh, need a 46 PC compatible better? Check. Microsoft Windows 3.1 or better? Check. 8 megabits of RAM? Check. 256 color display? Check. Mouse and a sound card. Oh, that's good. But here's the best part. This disc contains shareware and freeware programs. These shareware programs are not registered. You may be registered. Request about the other two. Submit a registration fee. See? Submit a registration fee before using the program beyond eight trial. So it's got shareware on it. Of course, value soft. And here's the really cool arcade games. It's, and it's on a compact disc data storage disc. Copyright 1997, Value Soft. I'm sure they're still in business. But I always remember seeing these things and thinking, oh, that's a pretty decent. And then you ever, you ever bought one of these, realized, man, that was a waste of my money. Uh, you get maybe about 10 minutes worth of fun, and that's it out of these. But we're going to play, or at least we're going to try playing some of the games. Uh, we're going to try playing some of the games, uh, either too fast, some of the games, no sound. Don't know why, because Windows 98 has sound. So that all works fine, but the games just, there's no sound. Uh, some of the games didn't play. Uh, the ones that look like they might be fun didn't play. And other ones, either play too fast, no sound. And there's maybe one or two games that were actually okay. So we're going to go play them. Let's go. Let's go quickly play some of these games all right so we have the windows 98 booted up and we have really cool arcade games fired up oh let's try, try, try the chomp and uh, let's go game new and this way i do know you have to change this uh delay because otherwise it goes full blast even though with the delay sometimes it doesn't do anything and so we'll set it here i'll set it to like 100 or so i go 120 new you can see this sucker goes full blast you can't even play this one so fast but it's kind of fun to play that way i guess of course the sound's not working probably because the speed's just all jazzed up look at me go look at me go actually i'm doing pretty good nope not anymore i don't know should we even try that so i try it again let's try mrs chomp so i guess that's miss pac-man Surprised I didn't get sued. This one's actually pretty good. And we had sound for a second, and then it's a little, little. Maybe that's about that's about normal speed. I don't know why the sound doesn't work on these guys. Maybe it's just they suck, or my sound card's not configured properly. But sound does work on everything else, except these games. Every now and then you get a blip. Let's close this guy. Let's try Squirmer. I'm thinking this is like Centipede. Yep, it's Centipede. It's really fast, though. It's pretty fast. <laughs> And the sound is gone. Eh, 
actually not a bad little game. <laughs> oh, and whack a rat. Kind of guess what this is going to be. A bad, sucky game. And looks like there's no sound again. Oh, you kind of get the idea. Not a lot of fun. Then I'll switch over to the next one. And we'll do bouncy balls. <clears throat> Okay, so this one I don't think is going to work. It wants Direct X. I don't think I, I don't know if I installed Direct X on here. At least that version. Ultra Blast. Uh, blah 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 blah. Shareware. Oh, that's wonderful. Oh, it's going to play. I think this is a uh, breakout. Maybe it looks kind of all messed up. Let's play it. Let's play it anyway. Yeah, let's break out. Break out where you can really move your guy around, apparently. Yeah, and I lost already. It's kind of too fast, I think. Let's try it. Try it one more time. Come on, let me hit let, oh, let me let hit one ball. Just one ball. Uh merrier than not. And done. Hi, I'm Steve Morant. Please per yeah, Let's try the next one. It is Space Action. Space Action. And you can see we got ABM command. Defend Droid. Space Invaders and Space Rocks 3D. I think Space Rocks 3D did not work. It was one of those games looks like it was probably one of the best ones. So, uh, Space Invader. Uh, let's try this one. Okay, that's wonderful. Let's play it. How do you play it? How do you play? There we go. Oops, I think I, I don't know what I'm doing here. I think the button I'm hitting is minimum. Oh, I'm hitting M, I think. And minimizing it. Whoa! There we go. I mean, it looks okay. Although it plays like crap. So really cool games. They are not. Not at all. Not even a little bit. Oop, I hit minimized again. All right, let's try Space Rocks 3D. I don't think this one's even going to try. I think it just crashes it. I get to pay for this one. And yeah, let's not even try that one. Yeah, we got Hurricane. This one is, I believe, just Tempest. Well, there you go. That was kind of basically Tempest. At least it had sound. That was good. Oh, 
Hyperoid. Okay, this is Space Invaders. This is actually classic Space Invaders. Of course, there's no sound either. It looks really nice. Actually, it did a nice job on this one. We can go backward and forward. But yet, no sound. So you kind of get the idea what these games were, just kind of knockoffs of uh, good games. But I guess if you only had like 10 bucks or 5 bucks, whatever this thing costs, it was like, well, you got your 5 bucks worth, maybe? Let's try Space War. I think this is uh, Space Invaders. Space Walls. Oh, yeah, this one, I have no idea. Yeah, no idea what I'm even doing, where my guy's at, what I'm doing. I think i got to avoid the tunnel or something. Anyway, next one. Next one, Warhead. This I'm going to guess Missile, Missile Command. Warheads for Windows. Ooh, very nice. I was thinking. Missile Command. I think there's another Missile Command on the next screen. We're going to see that one later. Oh no, I got my city. Take that city. And no sound, of course. I'm not sure what these hands mean. I beat it. Okay, you get the idea. You get the idea. See how do we close it? How do we close it? There we go. And we're going to the last pull down. Oh, Winroids. And this one looked like it'd be kind of fun, but uh, it's all key, key commands. It's going to be one of these buttons does something. There we go. Oh, hit W. Or M actually does minimize. Oh, I'm spinning. I'm spinning. Oh, there's my shield. Come on, i got to figure out how to fire. And if you got to figure out how to fire and move the move the thing, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be a sucky. Oh, really cool arcade games. 16 great games. Let me tell you something. There were maybe uh, one good game and 15 suck games, so they should really put this one okay game and 15 that are not so good. That's about what you got out of this. But it was good for a laugh. Um, Games are kind of interesting to play. Kind of need to look back at the uh, the good old days of Windows 3.1 or better. This is kind of what the games you got. These are the games you played. And these are actually probably pretty good at the time. Uh, I think it does say, one of the games I think when you launch this is, oh, hey, there's not, not a lot of games for Windows out there. It's like, yeah, because this is freaking old. But anyway, kind of neat to see the retro stuff. And I like the color of the case. So I guess that's kind of something there. So anyway, hope you guys enjoy the video. That you guys have a great day.